Hi, Brian here. I wanted to share with you an excerpt out of a book that I really enjoy, and it's right here. It's Jim Rohn's book, The Five Pieces to the Life Puzzle, and I wanted to read page 98 to you. But before I do that, what I want to do is read another quote from you from him to kind of set the stage for this. The big challenge is to become all that you have the possibility of becoming. You cannot believe what it does to the human spirit to maximize your potential and stretch yourself to the limit. Jim Rohn. Enjoy this short excerpt from this book I'm going to read to you. But remember before that, make sure you hit like, subscribe, share, and write a comment. You might not do all those, but at least do one of them. <laughs> Thank you. The two choices we face. Each of us has two distinct choices to make about what we will do with our lives. The first choice we can make is to be less than we have the capacity to be. To earn less, to have less, to read less and think less, to try less and discipline ourselves less. These are the choices that lead to an empty life. These are the choices that, once made, lead to a life of constant apprehension instead of a life of wondrous anticipation. And the second choice? To do it all, to become all that we can possibly be, to read every book that we possibly can, to earn as much as we possibly can, to give and share as much as we possibly can, to strive and produce and accomplish as much as we possibly can. All of us have that choice, to do or not to do, to be or not to be, to be all or to be less or to be nothing at all. Like the tree, it would be a worthy challenge for us all to stretch upward and outward to the full measure of our capabilities. Why not do all that we can, every moment that we can, the best that we can, for as long as we can? Our ultimate life objective should be to create as much as our talent, ability, and desire will permit. To settle for doing less than we could do is to fail in this worthiest of undertakings. Results are the best measurement of human progress. Not conversation, not explanation, not justification, results. And if our results are less than our potential suggests that they should be, then we must strive to become more today than we were the day before. The greatest rewards are always reserved for those who bring great value to themselves and the world around them as a result of whom and what they have become. 